Alright, and with the game starting here, we have the usual lineup. Cosmic Swarm playing Sigma. He's going to be the tank. We have... And... Alright, we have Germ. He's going to be Luke playing Soldier 76. Apex Shadow is going to be Matt playing May. Soapy Hat is going to be Henry playing Lucio. And... Romulus is going to be Sky playing Kiriko. So right now we're spectating Alex. He's going to be Cosmic Swarm. He's a tank and they quickly take high ground here. The game mode that they're going to be playing first is going to be capturing two out of three objectives. And so with the high ground here, they're going to keep pressure on the other team. A big rock and ice wall is going to separate the other team's tank from the rest of his team. They're going to do some high damage on him. He's going to drop down, and so he's going to try to keep doing damage to that tank. He gets him low under half again. They're going to be able to get that pick in as he pushes the rest of the team. And alright, so they're going to take out, it looks like, the whole team here there's just a tracer left and she's gone so that is a full team kill they're capturing the first point and so it looks like the other team was able to capture and get 21 percent but now ohio wesley has the point and is gaining up to 10 percent you can see it in the top middle of the screen and so let's switch it up here and we're going to spectate Germ, that's going to be Luke. He's playing Soldier 76. And so he's really good on high ground. He's going to stay up here, get the pick on the Lucio. Now he's going to shoot at the other team, Soldier 76, getting a little bit of damage, getting that all built up. It's at 80% there at the bottom middle of the screen. Trace is going to drop it all, and it's going to be an elimination. And so now we have Sky here up top. He's going to be a healer, Kiriko. He's going to be getting some damage done but also keeping the tank alive Alex able to not die there and get full health keeping the Henry the Lucio alive and so a big cleanse there and a big May alt that's going to take out the whole team there and Ramacha is going to be the only one left in the other team and so spectating Matt now He's going to be the May down here. Matt is a sophomore. And so he just used his alt. So he's going to have not a lot of alt charge right now. But he's going to be able to get that back quick with doing damage and also his abilities. And so doing some big damage here. He's able to wall off the tank there again. And then he's going to use his ice block. He's now already up to 40% all charge. And it looks like the other team is going to use two alts there. Three alts. And they're able to defend them off. But it looks like Matt is going to stay alive here. He's not going to die. The Kiriko doing a great job. And so he gets that kill there. And so, alright. They're going to get it up to 100%. And that's going to be the first round. Ohio Wesleyan takes the win. The other team did get a little bit of percentage there, but they weren't able to come back. And so with the score of 0 to 1, we'll see how the rest of this game goes. If they win this next round here, that will be the end of the match. Um, but if the other team does get this point, then they will go into a third round and to decide this final uh, for match 1. You check out the new Antler Antler album? You heard of that? Yeah. So, what you think? Oh, nobody uses 15 electric guitars like those guys. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. And we're going to switch it up here. And we're not able to catch up with him, but we're going to spectate Henry. He's playing Lucio here. He's going to move around but there he is and so they're going to try to go for this high ground right away you can see he's a very fast character he's a healer he's able to speed boost the team making them run faster as well as they shoot faster with their guns and so he also has a little healing circle and so he can only use one ability at one time 
but you can see he's really good for giving the team the extra movement and as well as keeping them alive he's really fast and he can run on walls and so they're gonna go back to this high ground that's something that's really important for them it looks like Sigma's going to fall down there but the rest of the team's going to sit up there and try to just get some alt charge do a little bit of damage here and there and Cosmic Swarm's going to stay on the point defending it making sure that the team can't get on there and so he's going to start to get pushed by the other team and get low a little bit and you can see everybody's going to come back down to help protect him And so playing around this little corner of this building here is really good for him because he's able to do damage but also stay alive to where he's not getting shot at. And so they're going to do damage. They're going to take out the tank there. And so now they're fighting the other team's Lucio. And so... Alright, it looks like... Ohio Wesleyan is going to keep this point. They're getting up to 70% here if they keep this point and win this round. That will be game. And so a big ult by Sigma, but he's going to get killed by the McCree on the other team using his ult. So now we just have May here, and she's going to get low. The only one left here is on point is Lucio, which is going to be Henry, and he's going to get picked off. And so with Ohio Wesleyan coming back into play, it's going to be 89% to about 10% with the other team getting closer to 100. They're going to have to hold this point and not let us take it back or else this round will be over. And so going back up to that high ground, he pushes the soldier there and there's going to be the tank and the healer right behind. And so they're doing some damage and there's going to be a big ult by the team's May that is Matt. And they're going to do some damage to the other team's tank. But he's going to be healed up by their healers. And it looks like Ohio Wesleyan is going to lose this team fight. The other team now at 50%. Ohio Wesleyan still at 89%. And so Matt, he just used his alt, so he's going to be down to 6% here. Um, we have Henry, which is playing Lucio, Soapy Hat, and Grum Grumulus, which is Sky, playing Hero Code. They're going to have their alts ready so they can use those. this team fight. They're both healers, which can be very, very beneficial of keeping their team alive. And so they're going after that high ground here. May's going to need to self-heal because she took some damage. Trying to get some shots here off on top. She's hitting some shots here. Not able to get any picks. That McCree is low, but does get healed by their other team. And it looks like there's going to be all used by Henry, our team's Lucio. And there's also an alt by the Captain Cosmic Swarm, Alex. And they're going to be able to get three picks, four picks now. And that's going to be a full team wipe there. And they're not going to be able to probably touch this point. They are going to use an alt here by Germ, our team's soldier. And nope, they weren't able to get to the point in time that round is going to end 1-0 to zero in this series of games. Ohio Wesleyan is up. And you can see play the game here by one of ours, Ohio Wesleyan. This is Matt. And so it's going to freeze the other team. He's going to be able to do some damage. Some great gameplay here.
And so it looks like for the second match, the other team is going to choose Rialto. That is going to be a push the payload map. So there is going to be a little car that going to that they're going to have to push through three objectives. So we'll see what side they're going to be on first. You'll play offense and defense for both teams. Whoever pushes the payload the furthest in the less, least amount of time will win the game. And it looks like they'll be starting up here in just a moment. All right, and Ohio Wesleyan is going to be on defense here first, and we have Cosmic Swarm that's going to be the captain. He's going to be playing Sigma again here, and so he's going to go up for this high ground. Holding this will be very important. You can see the other team has an Ariza, um, Soldier, Genji, Kiriko, and they don't have a healer yet. We're going to have a Sigma, Soldier, Mei, Moira and Kiriko and so the other team is going to choose a Lucio here and they're going to have this high ground the other team pushing that payload and so playing defense if this payload gets too far up they're going to drop down there and so they're going to use a May wall to give a little bit of cover doing a great job of defending not taking too much damage but May's going to get picked on Ohio Wesleyan here it looks like Soldier is going to get low, Moira low she's going to get picked off, Kiriko is going to get picked off and that's just going to leave the tank and the May here. Alex able to stay alive but he's going to take too much damage and so that's just going to leave them back here on defense. And so with the other team getting it to the first objective here they're going to have to push it two more. They still have five minutes and 26 seconds left. That's a lot of time. Ohio Wesleyan let them get the point too early. But let's see if their defense can improve here. And so it looks like they're going to play Reaper instead of Soldier. And that's going to be Luke who's playing Germ. He's going to be picked there. And so we're spectating Sky right now that's going to be Kiriko. He's going to be at 90% all charge healing the team while doing some damage here doing a great job. A big alt there by Matt but it looks like the other team is going to be able to get out of it and so there's going to be a counter alt. And so Genji going to be able to pick off most of the team here. Ohio Wesleyan might lose to the second point the team will have to push it one more in order for them to be done here we'll have to stop them and so we're spectating Henry who switched from Lucio into Moira he has his ultimate here and so he's gonna keep his team alive and do some damage and he's gonna take some there he's gonna phase out of there in order to keep himself alive and so Kiriko Sky is going to use his alt they're going to be able to get a pick on the soldier Kiriko on the other team is gone as well Ohio Wesleyan all staying alive getting four picks on the other team that's going to stop the payload that's the first time they were able to stop it so they're going to win this team fight the other team having five minutes and 13 seconds remaining in order to push the payload to the last point 
And so Moira still doing a good job here. We're going to switch over to Cosmic Swarm who decide to go with a different approach. Instead of playing Sigma, he's now playing Ariza, the same tank that the other team is playing. He has ultimate ready here. He's going to go up and do some damage to the soldier and Lucio. And he's doing a really good job of playing this little bit of high ground as well as that corner just kind of using that protection whenever things get kind of too heated just falling back in order to keep himself alive to protect his team he's going to use a big alt there because he saw the time was right they're going to be able to get a full oh it looks like soldiers able to get away but they got four players there on the other team that was a big alt there by the team captain Alex. and so all right they're going to be able to defend them for a full minute here there's four minutes remaining if they can defend them here for four minutes that would be really important for them um if the other team gets it all the way then they'll have to push the payload just as far and so there's going to be a bunch of alts used here it looks very confusing there's going to be a Kiriko all used on our team and the other team. There's going to be a Lucio all on their team used. Looks like a May all and a Soldier all. So a lot of alts used just right there. The big important thing about that fight right there is that Ohio Wesleyan stood their ground and that the other team did not get the payload to move. And so that's going to be very important. The other team only has two ultimates now. Ohio Wesleyan with not any ultimates currently. But with their defense at the moment, they should be able to defend the point here. And so right now we're spectating Matt, or Matt yep, who gets a really good wall there. They're able to pick the Ariza, they're able to pick the Lucio and the Genji. They're pushing the Kiriko here. She's one, pushing the Soldier. That's going to be a full team kill. No ultimates needed, just pure skill. Great play by Ha Wesley. And so May is kind of being a little bit more aggressive. They're on this lower ground in front of the payload, kind of stopping it from progressing. As May starts to take some damage here, Healer's doing a great job of keeping the team alive, not letting them down. And so May's going to put up an alt wall to protect herself, doing some more damage here. A big alt used by the tank. Alex and so it looks like they're going to be able to kill the soldier. They're going to get the Genji and they're going to get the Lucio as well. Orisa is going to be low on the other team. She's going to get picked off. Kiriko's left but she's going to teleport over to the other team's soldier keeping her alive. And now as we move over to Jerem here that's going to be soldier. He's going to be Luke as you can see him having some fun there. And so playing some great defense, being very patient. Reaper is a very aggressive character. Um, he has shotguns, which makes him close range. You can see he gets a great kill there on the Lucio. He's patient, he's aggressive, and he's using a great advantage of this Kiriko alt that does a speed boost to his shooting abilities. A great alt there that's going to be able to give him ultimate as well as the May. They're going to be able to hold this point here. It's been about three minutes that they held this point at, and they have one minute here remaining. Um, if they can hold it off, that will mean that they have a chance to push the payload. And it looks like he's going to get low, but he's going to be able to stay alive. Luke playing Reaper here. It looks like he's going to sneak around the backside and try to maybe get an ultimate here he won't need it because they get a big team sweep with matt using his ultimate the mccree's gonna fall off the map and so the whole team was just killed there on the other team by ohio wesleyan they're gonna respawn here they're gonna have a second chance the other team only having two ultimates available as well as ohio wesleyan um i will say ohio wesleyan's alts are bigger and more impactful so we'll see what happens here um, with the other team. 
And so Luke going to fall back. Let's watch him here because he can have a really big all as well as Alice the tank. And so the other team dropping all. So they're going to drop them together. That's going to be really big. They're going to get two picks there. They're going to get another pick here on the Arisa it looks like. And the Kiriko. Oh and it looks like he's going to pick there. But we still have Mei alive here. Almost having all. They're going to get three picks. Four picks. Only one person left alive. That's going to be the fifth pick there with May, Matt dropping all. Some great defense. The other team did a really good job being aggressive and getting it pushed pretty far there. Pretty far there. They pushed it two and a half um, objectives. So Ohio Wesleyan will just have to push it as far as them and they'll get a second win here if they do so. Systems online, weapons ready. Stay inside, and I'll keep you safe. Push your limits. Nothing breaks that I cannot mend. All right, an Apex Shadow, that's going to be May. We're spectating him right here. That's going to be Matt. He's going to do some damage here. And so he, they're going to be aggressive, pushing the payload. The other team holding the high ground there. It looks like they're going to keep the te same team build for Ohio Wesleyan and not switch it up. Sky, who is playing Kiriko, is going to get picked there. And the two DPS, Luke and Matt, are going to push high ground with the team captain, Alex. They're going to force the other team down, making them fight on lower ground. And so they're able to stay alive with the whole team of Ohio Wesleyan back. They're able to pick the other team's healer. The other, and so they're able to get two picks, both healers on the other team gone, which is very important. They're not going to be able to stay alive the more damage they do. And... All right, so it looks like the other team is going to push back there. Ohio Wesleyan now pushing this payload. And so let's go back and spectate Sky here who is playing Kirko. They're going to kind of stay behind this payload for some cover. They're throwing some healing out for their team, doing a little bit of damage. They're almost like a sniper. And so... And it looks like they're going to get two picks here on Ohio Wesleyan but they're going to be able to stay alive due to a great job by Sky who's and it looks like they're going to get a team kill so Sky and Luke are going to be able to kill the whole entire enemy team just by healing and doing damage and so we got Alex here who switched to Doomfist he's switching it up the other team is playing Zarya now um, and so he's going to do a little bit of damage there and it looks like the other team is playing Zen who can be a big problem for him just because that means he takes more damage a really big punch there just knocking the team back messing up their high ground positioning he's going to be up there fighting a Torb a Torborn is very um, bothersome because he does have a turn um, you can see it in the back there that's going to be something that um, is going to do a lot of damage to the team if you're not paying attention to it. And so Torborn is going to drop an ultimate there. That red stuff all over the ground is lava. You do burn when standing in it. And so it looks like Moira is going to ult. That's going to pick off 
Alex at playing tank and so you just have May, Matt here left and as well as Luke who's playing soldier. We're going to go over here and watch Luke play a little bit. And so how Wesleyan has pushed the payload to almost two objectives here. Every time you reach your objective, it does add more time on. Um, so they have 3 minutes and 17 seconds remaining. Um, but I believe whenever you reach the objective, it adds about between 1 to 2 minutes. Um, so that would give them more time to push it as far as the other team here. And when you look at the top of your screen and you see um, the score of how far they push the payload, the time remaining distance. You can also see the progress bar at the bottom on um, that gold uh, kind of diamond that you see there. That's how far they have to push it to win. And so Ohio Wesleyan doing a great job of doing a little bit of damage. Luke, the only one with alt here, he's gonna pop it right now. And so he's gonna do damage. He's gonna be able to pick off the other team's tank, pick off the other team's soldier, as well as the other team's Torborn. And that's gonna be a five player kill streak him here for him now. And he's gonna go up there and take the high ground. And it looks like Cosmic Swarm is gonna switch again. He's playing Mystery Heroes. And now he's playing Reinhardt. And so he's going to be able to get the Zarya there. A big fire strike hitting the soldier. And then he's going to charge and pin kill the Tor. They push the payload where they needed to. So that's going to be another win for Ohio Wesleyan. The score 2-0. to zero. They need to win three total games to win. We'll see what happens after this third match. And it looks like Apex Shadow Matt is going to get another play of the game here just doing a great job today really instrumental for the team And with the third match beginning here, it looks like they're going to play at Servasa. What that is going to be, that's going to be a capture the point map. It's going to be a little bit different from the first one that they played. The first game mode, they had to capture a point and then it would switch to another point and that would be best of three. Here, they're going to be able to capture it all within one same map. 
um, there will be no changes you'll capture a point you'll move on to the next one you'll see here once it starts um, but it will be a little bit different All right, with the game starting here, this is going to be a flashpoint game mode. Um, it's going to be very high pace, um, and so they're going to be able to do some damage here to the other team. The tank Alex going back to his Sigma gameplay, as well as Henry playing Lucio. They're going to be able to get a pick here on the other team's tank fast. Um, it looks like Luke was picked off at the beginning playing soldier, but he's going to be back in the fight here now And so with a great May wall able to pick off the other team's Lucio their other team's Mora's low Cosmic Swarm Alice getting that pick there. So that's going to be a full team Wipe and that's going to allow them to get the point and so switching it up here. We're going to go over to our Lucio who's bringing Luke back into the fight and so Soapy Hat Henry here is going to be playing Lucio that's going to be the speed boost character and so you can see that green um, kind of arrows on the right that's going to mean he's speed boosting when it goes over to yellow on the left that means he's going to be healing the team he switches back and forth in order to give them that advantage but also to give them that support and so he's going to have ultimate ready here what his ultimate does is it's going to drop a big um, sound barrier that's going to protect the team just giving them extra health and so how Wesleyan they capture the first point the other team did capture 25% of it but the they're going to get up to 100% almost here. It's going to go into overtime because the other team did touch the point before it was at 100. And so they get the point here. Henry getting into some trouble, trapped by a Maywall. He's going to get picked off. And so that's just going to leave Ohio Wesleyan with two teammates gone, three teammates gone. And it looks like Alex is going to get walled off here. That's might be the end of him and yes he does get picked off so then the other team picking off all of Ohio Wesleyan they come back here um, for the second point they capture one they'll need to capture three total in order to win Everyone, 
And so the other team's going to capture the point here. They're going to get it up to 50%. Ohio Wesleyan's going to have one point. The other team with zero. And they're halfway up to capturing it. If they can get up to 100% here, the score will be 1-1 one to one in this third match. And so Cosmic Swarm Alex going for this little bit of poke damage. Putting up his shield. Hitting them with bullets little by little. He's going to throw a rock. And it's going to be a brawl on the point. They're pushing up. There's going to be a bunch of alts used by Ohio Wesleyan and the other team. And so they're going to be able to pick off the whole team here. Ohio Wesleyan almost losing the first point or second points i apologize um but able to take it here in overtime so it's going to be 99 percent for the other team ohio wesleyan currently with 15 percent still going up and if they're able to hold this point here for as long as the other team did and capture it they will have the second point here the score would be two to zero um, but it's currently one to zero And so we're spectating Germ. That's going to be Luke here. He's going to be able to do some damage. He's playing Reaper again, being very aggressive, using a big alt there. He's going to be able to get two picks, three picks there on the Moira. He's going to be able to not get the May. Um, he was picked off there. The other team, even though we had a big push there, they were able to take the point. It looks like Ohio Wesleyan tries to touch the point there but Alex is unsuccessful the other team winning that point it's going to be one to one and so they're moving on to the next flash point here and so this flash point um, is best of five And with them coming up to the next point, you have Cosmic Swarm Alex in the front is the tank. And so they're going to get walled off there. That's going to wall off the Reaper who is Luke. There's going to be a big May all used by the other team. They're going to get a pick there, but we're also going to get a pick. It's currently 4-4 four to four with players. And it looks like... Oh, and Sky almost fell off the map there, but was able to keep himself alive. And so with the score still 4-4 four to four with players left alive, the other team was able to capture this point. They're currently up to 40%. Ohio Wesley is still struggling to get the point back. They were doing well at the beginning here. Um, they're going to have to keep up that pressure and keep playing well in order to get this win. Looks like they're going to have to fall back a little bit. The other team now reaching up to 65%. And it looks like, ah, and so Sky is not going to be able to stay alive there. He's going to be booped off the map by the other team's Lucio. And now we're going to go over to Matt here. He's May. He had the two best plays in the first two games back to back. He's been doing really well today. He's going to have ultimate ready. There's going to be a May wall used by both teams. He's going to drop his ultimate there. That's going to trap a lot of the other team. He's going to try to do some damage, but he's unsuccessful. He's going to get low here. He's most likely not going to be able to stay alive, and he does get picked off there. And so big alt there by Luke, who is Germ, but he's also going to get froze in the May ultimate, and he's going to get picked off. That's going to leave only Alex, who is playing tank here, but he is able to get the pick in order to save the point and not let the other team get it and so with the help of sky who is playing kiriko gromulus he's going to be able to keep him alive and so sky being a healer he's only a freshman but he's very good at the game um he's very good at sniper players i've seen him play hanzo he's very good at just landing those shots and so looks like the other team is going to be aggressive here getting Alex down pretty low but they're going to be able to pick off the May do a lot of damage and it looks like Soldier's going to try to ult there 
and Alice is going to step up and try to defend his team. And so a big ultimate there by Sophie Hat that's going to be Henry. He's going to keep the team alive. And it looks like the other team's Moira is going to use the ultimate. You have Alex here on the defense. And so he's going to lose both of his healers. He's going to probably have a hard time staying alive because of this. They're probably going to lose this point. And yep, they're going to pick off Matt Apex Shadow there. And you had Germ, who was just responding, now switching to McCree, that is Luke. And so with the score 2-0 to zero now, if the other team does capture another point, that will be the end of this third match. But if Oha Wesleyan is able to get these two wins here, um, or at least one, and able to keep this game alive... And so we're watching Germ here. He's going to be Luke. He's going to have his ultimate ready. And so you can see him going around the side here. He could have something in plan. And yep, he does use his ultimate. He's able to pick off the other team's healer, Moira. He's going to do some damage to the other team's and so oh, the other team's tank did use big alt there but they were able to counter it counter it with the may alt and so that's going to be able to sweep the other team and they're going to capture that point then with the first capture having 50 per 15 percent the other team zero And so our team for Ohio Wesley and Matt playing May is going to get picked off as well as Sky playing Kiriko. The other team is going to take the point from us, from us falling back just to regroup. It's going to be 45% to about 15%. The other team still going up. And so with no ultimates ready here by Ohio Wesleyan, they do have two ultimates available for the other team's DPS. The other team really coming alive in this third match, doing a great job of being aggressive, um, kind of giving Ohio Wesleyan a hard time, but they're still doing a good job. It looks like they're going to switch to Ana here. That's going to be Sky. He's going to try to keep his team alive as well as try to hit some antis so that the other team can't be healed. A big sleep there, but they're going to get walled off. And so with the other team reaching about 80% here, Ohio Wesleyan will need to take this point or that will be game. And so they're coming up to 90%. They have to touch. They only have one ultimate ready for Lucio, but that's a big ultimate. He's going to drop it here. The other team's soldier is going to drop his ultimate. And so with Sky trying to keep his team alive here, he's able to get the soldier. Now with the other team only having four people left, they pick off the tank now it's this it's four to three four to two and so they're gonna get that pick there and now it is five to one Ohio Wesleyan with their whole team and so it looks like everyone on the other team is gonna respawn here and come back alive the other team did reach for uh, 99 percent Ohio Wesleyan up to 65 percent and so if they're able to get this point here, the game will continue. Um, but if they lose this point here, the game will be over. And now moving over to Sophie Hat here. He's playing Lucio. Sorry about that. Oh, and so we have a big ultimate. Let's switch over here to Alice. He's the tank actually here. He's going to get a big ultimate getting two picks. It looks like he might get a third on this Junker Queen here, but he is very low. The healer is doing a great job of keeping him alive. He's in the middle of his ultimate. He's going to get two picks on the Moira and Junker Queen. That's going to be big team kill right there. Ohio Wesleyan able to keep the point. That was huge for them because that puts them into the last flashpoint. It is best of five here. So whoever um, wins this point is going to have the game.
And so with 2-2 two to two on the scoreboard, as they approach the last and final point here of this match, it will be available in 8 seconds. And so with the point coming available here, the other team is already on the point. Ohio Wesleyan fighting from this high ground here. And the, as the flashpoint unlocks, they push in. Alex taking a lot of damage, getting walled off by the May, so that's going to cause him to get picked off there. Henry, the Lucio, is going to get picked off as well. Matt May is taking a lot of damage. He's hiding in this ice block, trying to stay alive. He's going to get picked off, and you see that Soldier Germ is dropping back in order to get cover um, with the rest of his team taking a lot of damage and getting picked off there. He's just trying to stay alive, and so... He's going to pick off and do a little bit of damage. And he's over there with Alex. And so you can see him doing a little bit of damage, dropping a healing pad. He's going to go up to the top. There's going to be alt used by May. He's going to May alt. And so big May alt by Ohio Wesleyan and an alt used by the other teams tank and they're going to be able to get picks on the whole enemy team here and there we go how wesleyan getting a team kill able to take this point germ coming up to 97 percent alt charge almost able to use his ultimate here and so the score is 15 percent to about 90 percent there and it is two to two And if they can reach 100% on this point, they'll win. But if they're unsuccessful and the other team gets there first, that will be the end of this match. And so Germ is going to use his ultimate here. You have Soapy Hat, which is Henry, with his ultimate. He's going to drop it here now. And so each team's healers are both going to drop their ultimates. He's going to fall back here because the rest of the team is going to get picked off. The other team coming up close to 99%. And so he's going to have to touch this point here in order to... And so he's not able to. It looks like the other team is going to take this first... Or uh, this third match here. And so they're going to play one more. Um, and let's see how this goes. And it looks like Alex here, the tank, would play the game here, doing a great job.
Time for the reckoning! Some zinc trunk. 